Hi, I'm Jennifer Garapy, the pet therapist. I tell you what your pets would say if they could talk to you. So today I just wanted to um, continue this week of health and hope for our pets by telling you a little bit more about what I do and um, a, um, a client success story that really um, inspired me to keep on my journey. So I work with pet owners whose pets have um, health or behavioral challenges. And one of my early clients was actually one of my neighbors, and she was um, a little skeptical actually about what I do, but she agreed to give it a try. And she and her family had gone on vacation, and they, um, unfortunately, their cat while they were on vacation had been terrorized by their, um, by a dog. And because of that, when they came home, their cat started peeing outside of the litter box in the home. And their cat was peeing um, inside their shoes, um, on their beds, on their clothes that were left on the floor. And obviously it was pretty distressing um, to, to my client. And so um, she called me over to, to work with her cat. And after a series of um, maybe about four sessions of working with her cat, um, her cat um, stopped peeing outside the litter box and hasn't done it since. And not only that, but um, it was really sweet for me to hear her say, um, thank you, Jennifer, we have our cat back. And it was, it was especially sweet for me to hear her say that because she, um, you know, she loved her cat, but I don't know if you've ever smelled cat pee. It's, it's really um, a, a very difficult um, stench to tolerate. And um, because of that, because it was getting all over everything, she was seriously considering, um, you know, taking her cat to a shelter where um, it's likely that the cat would have been euthanized because nobody else is going to want to adopt a cat that's peeing outside the litter box. And after the work that I do with a cat as well, um, one of the amazing side effects of the work that, um, that I do is that because animals become more true to themselves and the loving nature that they have, um, they actually become um, typically much more um, friendly and and loving with their pet people. And so um, her cat became, um, became much more affectionate with her and this brought her a lot of joy because she wanted that connection with her cat. And so that's just a little snippet of um, the work that I do and what keeps me motivated to, um, to continue to work in this field. And I would love to have you join me um, on this journey to continue to learn more about pet health and happiness and behavior. And if you'd like to join me, please type the word champions in um, the comments, and I'd be happy to send you the link to join the group. Thank you so much. And by the way, this is my one of my sweet cats, um, Tango. And uh, he's obviously a little busy cleaning himself. But thank you and have a great rest of your day. Bye-bye.